What's up guys? Uh, just thought I'd make a quick video. I'm out here in Glen Rose checking out my hog trap. Can only come out here every three three or four days of the week. So uh, it's kind of tough trying to come out here and check it and head back home and nothing's in there. You know, I gotta come back out after another four days. So can't check it every day, but the day I do come out here and check it, there was a boar in here. He's laying right up underneath this tree right here. And uh, I spooked him. He, he jumped up, started charging out the fence. Can't I don't know if you could tell, but I did. he did bend the shit out of this fence right here. He ran into it, looked at me, and he come over here and decided he wanted to jump over this fence. And he cleared it. He jumped over it turned around started running straight for me i was about right here and uh he ran stopped about 15 feet away from me and i pulled out my 45 and popped him in the i think i believe i popped him in the hip because he turned around and when he turned around he was broadside ended up popping him in the hip and um, he ran up underneath these uh this neighbor's property so i really have no clue if there's any blood trail or anything i don't really want to go over here i don't know any of these these people but yeah i'm pretty sure this is where they're staying it's all dense back over here uh caught a couple times where there's been pigs coming up underneath here and uh for about two weeks now that uh boar has been trying to get into this trap and he finally did and what do you know he ends up jumping over the fence so i'm gonna try to come up with some effective way of uh keeping them from jumping over the fence i do have another trap back over probably about 100 yards from here and it's a smaller trap we caught a big ass boar in it way bigger than the one that was in this trap and uh he had no problem staying in it i mean he ended up uh i'm pretty sure how big this trap is that they actually have enough room to be able to run and uh jump over the fence so uh i think that's going to be one of our problems right here is uh how wide this is but like i said that one over there is pretty small that trap is probably only about 10 feet wide in diameter so they don't have enough room to be able to get that momentum to jump over the fence so that's what i'm thinking that's our problem is how wide this trap is but i'm gonna find some way of uh keeping them from jumping over the fence might put some tannerite in the ground so when I do show up, I just shoot the ground and they blow up, but 